welcome back to my channel I am going to do a DIY today I'm going to make some toilet balms and for that I need baking soda I need citric acid I bought some you need some oil and I bought cranberry mandarin two dollars at Walmart I got two bowls for it to sit in one for my bathroom and one for my husband's bathroom. Then I got two ice trays to put them in. I'm going to need a bowl, a fork, and measuring cups. And you're also going to need a water bottle and a towel because I believe it's going to be messy. This is my first time trying it. Let's see how it turns out. First you're going to need a cup and a half of baking soda. You need half a cup of citric acid. Okay, you're gonna mix those together in a bowl and then you're gonna put your, your drops in there. And you put anywhere from 30 to 40 drops just depending on what you want. And you're just gonna mix that together well. I'm gonna take this towel and put it down real quick. And you're just gonna mix Okay, from there, spray bottle wasn't working, so I had to get another one. So you want to spray. You don't want to put too much water in it. And you want to stir it. You want it in loose clumps. But you want it to be able to mold into like a little ball. You want to continue to do that till you get it to the consistency that you want it to be at. And you don't want to over spray it because then it won't stick together. Spray it just a little bit more and I think it'll be to the consistency I need it to be. And this is where the messy part comes in. It's supposed to be able to form a ball. So I think that is good enough. And I'm going to start putting it in the tray and packing it down. Doesn't look like I'm gonna need both trays. I'm gonna test this out and then if I decide I like it, I'll make some more. This is the messy part. supposed to gel. Yeah, see how it's puffing up now. <laughs> well, look how it's puffing up. Okay guys, this is it. I'm going to let these dry overnight. They keep puffing up, but I'm gonna let them dry overnight and um, they should be ready in the morning. And then I will, I'm gonna change containers because I need to put them in an air, airtight container. So I'm going to get some that seal and I will let you see the end results of these tomorrow.
Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you enjoyed this project. Again, this is the toilet bombs, and I will leave the ingredients in the in the description box below. Guys, this is what the final results look like. I'm going to do it again, and I'm going to get a different kind of... Um, I'm going to get a different container to put it in. But these are the jars I ended up with. I got them from Target. And they were in the dollar spot area. So I used some yesterday. I had some leftover and I used some yesterday in the toilet. It smells so good. But this is the final result. And like I said, I'm gonna get something a little bit smaller than those. So I was put in an airtight container. And since my bathroom is pink and gray, I got me a pink one. And I got my husband a white one. But this is the final results. And I'm happy with it. And like I said, I used it yesterday and I like the way it foamed up and it made the toilet smell really good bathroom as well so guys thanks for watching i will put all the ingredients in the description box below and this was my first time doing it maybe next time it'll turn out a little better thanks for watching